What's up, guys? I'm back posting videos. Long story short, as to why I haven't been posting videos, uh, I just broke my mic over in the Among Us game. Yeah, I know, very fucking deplorable. It's a low point in my life, but I'm hoping we can move past it now because I have a new mic. As much as I hate myself for breaking my mic over a fucking 2D Flash game, I found something on Instagram that is probably way more despicable and deplorable and actually makes me look like a fucking angel. So I came across this post because someone put it on their story and let me be clear, I don't disagree with the message here, but one thing in the top right corner did catch my eye. That's a fucking Sharingan from Naruto. So I'm thinking to myself, that's not a reach, right? Like that actually looks like Itachi Sharingan. I go into the comments and check that other people agree that, yeah, it looks like Itachi's eye from Naruto. I really don't even have a problem with these pages posting positivity and shit like that. It's just, it's sad because they attract these people who have a stick up their ass 24-7. So whenever you try to make a lighthearted joke about anything whatsoever, they take it as disrespect when it's really not the case. These are just people pointing out similarities. To be fair, it's not just the followers. There are also people who come on this page just to talk shit and troll. But I'll take a troll over someone who can't take a joke. Like this individual right here. The comments about the stoma red circle make me sick. I have one myself. I've never been more upset. Lady, you need to pick your words a bit more carefully. You've never been more upset before? So you're trying to tell me you lived your entire life to what I'm guessing is late teens? And an Instagram post where people talk about a fucking Sharingan is what drove you off the edge? That's a very privileged life if you ask me. I wish that someone talking about fucking Sharingans on Instagram was what made me the most upset in my life. For those of you unfamiliar, the Sharingan has this power. It's kind of like hypnosis and it puts you in like a fake reality or some shit like that. And honestly, I think that's fucking real because the moment I looked at this picture, my life has been fucking ridiculous. And it starts with this woman right here. Yeah, so Newsflash is not a Sharingan. Surprise, surprise. Apparently, it's a surgery that you get in your stomach called a stoma, which, after looking at some pictures, looks nothing like the one in the art. But, hey, that's me. Probably a subjective thing. And apparently, everyone is supposed to know what that is because the second comment here says that people are so uneducated. And that's a very common procedure, and it's nothing to be ashamed about. And we shouldn't let the incels get us down. Because everyone who watches Naruto is an incel. I'm starting to think that she's just saying bullshit for the sake of being supportive because I found that only 1 million people in North America have the surgery. And to put that in perspective, the population of North America is 579 million. So if you ratio that, that's 0.17% of North America's population. Not a big number, especially not big enough for you to be calling it common. And of that 0.17% of the population, the average age is 68. So according to this person right here, if you don't know about a condition that 0.1% of the population have and that most of them is 68 years old, you're uneducated. And it's funny because for the first time in feminist Instagram history, men and women alike are having fun joking about the Sharingan. And here comes this person, the same motherfucker trying to crash the fucking party, talking about some, it's the disrespect for me. Like, bitch, you're the only one pressed about this shit. So I decided to go on her story to see if she was still suffering from her schizophrenic anger episode, and man, was my prediction correct. She starts to go off on a tangent about how insensitive and uneducated people are, when in reality, she's probably just angry that a Japanese cartoon is more famous than the type of surgery. Why can't she just comprehend that people are taking note of what they see and not making fun of people with the surgery? It's like she just goes around looking for people who step slightly out of line in order to make herself look like the good guy when she calls people out on it. No one's falling for your savior complex, bitch. You're just a party pooper. 